today I'm going to craft. I have had a really crappy just month, year, whatever. I feel like everyone has, but I have trigeminal neuralgia and occipital neuralgia, and I had to wean off of a med completely before I could start like trying out a new one. So just full pain, <laughs> which sucks. So, um, I also have a very, very sick kitty cat who, um, he was diagnosed with a lymphoma and we're waiting for culture results. So it's just been a fun week. Like, just. So I need something simple and um, something with instructions. I don't want to use my brain. So once again, my lovely husband is here to assist. He got me this. Yeah, um, it's a little resin craft. Um, this is UV resin. So I'm just going to open this up and follow the instructions and we'll see how ugly I make these at the end. And today to also help numb the pain will be a Breckenridge Brewery Vanilla Porter. I I'm not picky when it comes to drinking. I'm not. No. Mm. It's so yummy. All right, I brought in a lot of, I've got like a lot of like, these are supposed to go on fingernails. And <laughs> I bought these little gems. I honestly don't even remember what for, but. And this thing looks like it comes with like a million little gems and stuff too that mimic what I have pretty much exactly. <laughs> oh, that hurts. <coughs> I can't lose these. These are like the main pieces. I, oh, if I just stop yanking on it, it'll pop out. We call that the Hulk smash. Um, so this is obviously like a mold. It's like a little silicone resin mold. Um, and then it came with these little pendant things that I can fill, which I have three of those, a circle one, an oval, and a little teeny heart. First step is figure out your life with what you want to do, which is probably the uh, hardest step because I'm going to just do all of these things. I'm going to do a little mold one and I'm going to fill all these little pendants, but I got to figure out what the hell I want to put in them. And that I think is going to be the hardest part. We'll see. We'll see what I end up with. 90% chance it's going to be ugly. <laughs> Another thing that I'm just really trying not to do is spill shit everywhere. And break these flowers. Okay, 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 okay. That's cute. That's cute. There's these little pearls in here, and they are so staticky. They're stuck. Fuck. <laughs> They're stuck to the wind. <laughs> Apparently not if you tip it upside down. Okay, but come on, man. Shit! Start with a mold or bezel. For open-backed bezels, use resin tape to seal the back. Carefully pour UV resin into mold or bezel. Use a stick to spread evenly and remove the bubbles. Sticks. AKA... Toothpick. I appreciate it. Oh, I think I'll just add like a bunch of these little gems and then a heart in the middle and we'll call it a, we'll call it a day. This would probably have been way cuter if I would have just left all of the gems out. Um, so the next one is like this little circle pendant doohickey majig. So go ahead and put this stir 
on here. Oh, my face hurts. Okay, that didn't. It's just a happy little accident. It'll be fine. Next up in my terrifying, it's a little oval. Let's make this one really simple. I'm gonna just throw a bunch of these little gems around the edge, like whatever. Me saying, let me do this one super simple, cut to me taking the tiniest rhinestones that I can find. I don't know if you can even see them, but doing an outline around the entire thing. <laughs> and they keep flipping over. The opposite of easy. I picked the hardest thing I could have done. But that's cool. Everything's fine. I'm fine. Everything's it's fine. <clears throat> it took like 22 of those little teeny, teeny, tiny things to fill that itty bitty little oval. So now I'm accomplished and I can die happy. And last but not least, there's this little tiny heart. <laughs> I'm just a little guy. Okay. So, oh, customize by adding flowers, glitter charms, and other inclusions into your UV resin. Too late. Um, and then the last one is cure the UV resin with a UV light for one to seven minutes between layers or until no longer tacky to the touch. Okay. This has been awesome and fun and I love this and I, but some of my things are going to be tacky no matter what. <laughs> Sorry. <gasps> Whoop. Okay. Time to cure in a UV light. And yes, I have like a jumbo size <laughs> UV light that you guessed it. My husband bought for me. <laughs> I do it kind of like a pizza in an oven and like <laughs> put them on here and then stick them in there. <laughs> you just, <gasps> look. Oh, you can't see. <laughs> look it, check it out. I said check to check, 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 I uh, check it out. Look, like a glove. Oh crap. All right, now, don't F this up. F this up, don't F this up. Oh. oh, my heart stopped for a hot second there. All right, and then I'm gonna turn this on. Oh, oops, there. And wait one to seven minutes, I guess. I don't know, I'll finish this beer. My next painkiller, by the way, is Breckenridge Juice Drop Hazy IPA. Just got a Breckenridge variety pack and uh, yas, delicious. Okay, the smell of my hands from the, the gloves <laughs> ruined my first sip. <laughs> Ah, okay. <clears throat> Keep your composure. Keep your hands, obviously, weigh the F down here and then take a sip. And when in doubt, pinky's out. That is a very nice IPA. Soft, lush, and intensely juicy. <laughs> My watch went off, seven minutes is gone. Okay, so I can turn this off and just move my junk. To show you guys, coming out of the oven. <laughs> All right, there's still a lot of bubbles. Let me check this big dude. Well, he's not sticky. I'm gonna pop it out. Okay, that's a little tacky on the back budge. Okay, 
I'm gonna put it back in the oven just for like, like maybe it's still tacky. Just the big guy. Take whatever. Not two or three or whatever. Okay. This guy's not tacky anymore. You can come out of the oven. I don't know. They're not like sticky, icky, icky, icky. Like this guy is a little. Ooh, ooh! Why don't they give me four? These are little things to put on it. They gave me two little things, but they gave me four things to make. So this shouldn't be like a hot dog bun and hot dog situation. Like this should be, you should make these things add up. Because now I gotta pick a favorite. <clears throat> Rude. Which obviously isn't that one. <laughs> <It's ugly. laughs> I think you gotta pull this apart. Ooh. See? You pull it apart and then there's like a little clamp clamp. And then you just stick this guy in here. And then you clamp it, clamp it shut. And then you have it on the thing. Okay, this is too big. Too big! Oh. Piranha. We live in the Amazon. That is lovely. Minus like my fingerprints that I'm fairly certain I baked into it. <laughs> Alright, so then let's... Let's do this, do this, do this, do this, do this now. Cover up my cleavage. Yeah? Eh? Very nice. This was a super cute project. It was nice. It was what I needed. I needed to commit to shutting my brain off because... I am in pain and I just keep thinking about my poor sick kitty. So thank you for committing with me. Um, yeah. Like my page. Like yourself. That's what we're here for.